Hello everyone, it's me Jessa again and welcome back again to my channel. So happy Easter everyone and since it's Easter today, our video will be related to Easter tradition in Finland. Uh, if you remember that I already shared with you guys the traditions and some uh, food that we eat here in Finland during that holiday. So today we will be doing and we will taste their sweet dessert in Finland. And years later. Let's this begin this mena and let's start to open it and taste it. So you just need to open it like this one here. We have a tape here that one and then in the other side as well we also have a tape like here this one oh it's kind of hard to open it so ta -da! and then if you see it look ta -da! <laughs> so this is like this one it's black it looks like I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck? The mema, man. So let's. I have here a plate with me. So I will try to get some of it, but not a lot, because we will just try to taste it. And let's see if you can see it. So I will get a little bit here. Oh, see, it's like this. Look. Like that, let's put it in a plate. Oh, <laughs> did you see it here? So let's try to taste it, guys. Mm. It's not that, it's not bad, but it's like there is this the texture is like uh like sand or something mm. I thought it was bad but not not really it's okay they said that you can eat this one with you can add some milk or cream whipped cream in it but let's try first with just this one just just this memo and nothing on it mm. Actually, it's really okay. Hmm. They said that if you will eat this mema, this mammy, uh, you don't have to eat a lot because it's not good for your stomach. You can get like diarrhea or something. <laughs> so we, let's just eat like a little bit of it. Hmm. It's okay. So I have this one milk because they said it's okay if you will add milk. So let's try. If the taste will be different from the original so I will try put a little milk here it's like that if you can see it I already have a milk so let's try like this and so let's see if the taste will be different from the other first when I added it It does change a little bit, but the, it's that it's that texture that. Hmm. It reminds me of that dessert from Bohol. What's that one? That kalamai. Yeah. It's a little bit the same, like this one, because when you look at it, it's like a little bit of that kalamai. Actually, kalamai is all over, but it's like mm, they have made a lot in Bohol, and that one is really, really taste. So it looks like this, this mema, here, mema. This is a traditional mema. This one because they have they put something like a different or like yeah different 
taste like flavor like they have this lumu it says like organic something organic mema and they have this different flavor but i just buy and i try this one this this the original this is traditional mema well let's see if i can find the ingredients or something here but actually this mema is like originally made from rye bread yeah and I don't really like the rye bread here in Finland because it's hard and it's so dry. So it's not my type. Let's see. Uh, it's in Finnish. <laughs> Let's try to read if we can understand it. Uh, this one is, you have to put it in a, in a frozen before you eat it. It says it's, you will put it in a negative 18 degree Celsius. So you have to frozen it and it will last it also says here that it will last for like after you open it it's like when you get it from the frozen from the freezer so you can store it in the refrigerator for three weeks uh, i didn't find the ingredients really this one is contents nutritional contents it has energy with 0 0.9 grams uh, the sugar is 10 grams it's here in this one but it's in Finnish uh, of course because we're here in Finland so the food and the labeling is in Finnish and it also have a Swedish here at the other side uh, here's the ingredients yeah it's rye bread salt and preservatives Romeran skull I don't know what is that <laughs> so so that's it I have tried their uh, Easter dessert tradition this one this man and it's okay it's not that bad but it's just like that texture it's like there is that little bit of sand and something wait a second I don't know if you can eat this one with a with a bread like you will put it like in the middle because we usually use it in the Philippines if you all if you also do that one like when we buy uh, kalamai what's the English word of kalamai <laughs> so when we buy a kalamai you can put it in a bread so you will spread it in the bread so it's just like palaman it's like palaman you know so mm. It's okay, it's not bad at all. A few moments later. So our video ends here guys. So thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to click the subscribe button. Like and comment and share. Bye bye. See you in my next vlog. Thank you.